niko na na uchuku sana cho mifano 2022 January nilifikanga mwingine nilipewa ruhusa kutoka Saudi nikaenda tena nikarudi huko sasa sasa hivi ili forti nilipokea kutoka Guys, huyu mtoto mwenye mnaona hapa anaitwa James Chege, alipotea Feb na mamake yako Saudi Arabia, nataka msikize vile mamake ana, anasema. Okay, shifana nimerudi. Uswangu amesaa toka kidogo. Ameenda kununua vitu vingine hapo. So, nilikuwa nakuambia hivi ifano. Uh, last month, February the 10th nasikia ndio mtoto wangu alitoroka na na toka detio 10 hajawahi patikana na na sofa walikuwa ngawana ni ficha hawako nataka kuniambia hata vile niliwatumanishia nini voice nyumbani walisangaa wakaniuliza kila mtu ananiuliza nani alikuambia ukie uki ukitesti uki huyu unamuuliza Unajua Jimmy alipotea wananiuliza eh nilisikia batia natafutwa tena wananiuliza ni nani alikwambia so ni kama kitu iliongelewa nisiambiwe nikiwa sauti ya sasa mimi nilikuwa nataka unisaidie kumpost nini yako FB yako chuo mimi niko na, na uchuku sana cho mifano 2022 January nilifikanga mwingine nilipewa ruhusa kutoka Saudi nikaenda tena nikarudi huko sasa sasa hivi ili forti nilipokea kutoka mtu wako Qatar ndiye aliniambia imambo na ni mambo nilipokea update ile FN so mimi niko na uchuku sana na uliza kila mtu aweze kuipost juu ili mtoto wangu apatikane hmm? sana niko na uchungu sana ifado stini fanyache na watu ndio waeleza mtoto wangu apatikane wana niambia shara ataonekana hichi hichi na tumesubwana na wao mambo ya kwenda huko mimi nilimaliza contract September 2023 but hadi sasa hii niko tu Saudi ya sio mimi nifanye hivyo hapo hebu nisaidie ni tu kumpost ili nione kama atapatikana Ya yeah, so guys, huyu mamake anaitwa mamake by the way yako Saudi Arabia na it is very unfortunate guys. huyu uh, kijana mwenye mnaona hapa anaitwa James Chege ama Jimmy. Alipotelea huko Moranga County. Mamake anaitwa Elizabeth Wanjira Chege. Mamake aliniricha uta kanielezea kaniambia kama naweza msaidia kushare pia nyinyi guys ninaomba mshare hii video kwa ma groups kwa ma what kila mahali ma groups zote za Facebook ma groups zote za WhatsApp kama we ni team strong guys na una watch hii video please i urge you to share because she is in Saudi Arabia Anasema mtoto wake alipoteanga tu hivyo 2021 alafu akapatikana kama amekufa na sasa huyu ni mwingine ako na 12 years ako na 12 years na alikuwa anakaa na shosho yake na babu yake na mtoto akatoroka na kuna kitu nataka kuambia Tim Strong kama wewe unajua uko majuu na maybe unapiga simu hakikisha unaongea na mtoto wako two days after two days hata kama umeshikana aje Make sure unaongea na mtoto wako. Guys, I told you your kids may be suffering 
Unaona tu mtoto kwa screen akikuchekesha akifanya nini but behind the scenes mtoto wako may be suffering. I told you guys, I told you. Ebu imagine guys mtu wako Saudi Arabia. Watu watu wao wanajua mtoto wake amepotea na waezi muambia. Eh? Sasa hii tunaelekea sasa hii tuko Ramadhan. Ni ni, ni mwajirimu gani ataitikia kukupea ruhusa? Ju hakuna mwajiri mwenye hakuna mwarabu mwenye anaweza kukupea ruhusa ati kisa mtoto wako amepotea. Mnajua tu waarabu guys. Hmm? Aya kitu kingine yenye nauliza mtoto alitoroka kwa nini alitoroka juu mtoto haizi toroka kama ateswi mtoto haizi toroka kama achapwi mtoto haizi toroka kama hakuna huyo mtoto alikuwa anapitia sana na hata ukiangalia huyo mwingine mwenye alikufa 2021 pia yeye kuna ile kitu yenye walimfanyia wazazi ni kwa nini mnafanya hivyo shame on you Munaachiwa watoto wengine hata nasikia munatumiwa pesa munazimisuse munatumiwa tena munazimisuse alafu sasa mtu akisota awambie ana pesa munaanza kumuita majina na huyo ni mtoto wako mwenye umezaa wazazi kwanza nyinyi wazazi nyinyi wazazi ndio nyinyi tu ndio mnapea watu wenye wako golf stress nyinyi ndio mnafanya mtu ajinyonge akiwa huko nyinyi ndio mnajifanya watu wakuwe na depression huko Saudi Arabia Hakuna mwarabu anatesa nini. Hata kama wako ni 10%, lakini wazazi, unaona wazazi na ma sister na ma brothers na ma relative, nyinyi ndio you are the cause of kwanza death zenye zina happening huko Saudi Arabia. Huko Gulf, not even Saudi Arabia, huko Gulf. Na nyinyi wazazi hata hamuna adabu. Nyinyi wazazi kama una watch video na unajua mtoto wako ako Gulf. Auna maisha, auna adabu wewe, auna adabu. Ju kila saa una kila saa una, una muitisha tu pesa, eh? Badala mtoto wako akikutumia pesa uangalie vile unaweza invest hizo pesa zizaane. We ni kukula tu kukula tu na ujui mtoto anateseka aje. Mnajua yale mateso yanakuanga pale golf. Kwanza wacheni ni waambie si wadanganye. Hao watu wenye wako golf kulala inakuanga ni shida. Kwanza hata huko kuna wenye hawapatangi usingizi kabisa kabisa. Hmm? Kuna wenye wanakulanga mabaki. Kuna wenye ukipewa hiyo salari yako, my friend unakuanga umefanya kazi unasikia tu mgongo ikikatika kukatika. Unafanyishwa kazi ni kama we ni punda, hata punda iko afadhali. Hiyo siku yenye unalipwa salari. Kitu ingine, watu huko unafanyanga kazi yani unapiga manguo pasi, eh? Na hata hakuna maziwa yenye unakunywa. Na hapo ujue hiyo pasi ni ile ya kunyonya mtu damu. Na hakuna maziwa yenye kwa hapo ama mafruits ama nini. Kuna wengine waarabu hata wanafichianga wa Kenya kama ni machocolate hizi vitu mzuri mzuri wanafichanga chini ya kitanda, wanaficha chini ya kitanda kwao. Unapata uwezi enda kunini hizo vitu. Do you know guys kuna wa Kenya wenye, wenye wanafanya kazi huko Gulf? Eh? Wanafanyi, wanafanyiwa sex, sex harassment. Mtu anajipata tu akirepiwa na mtu wa hiyo nyumba, mubabu wa hiyo nyumba. Eh? Kenyans are suffering in Gulf countries. You parents, you, you, you wanna you, you have to stop this nonsense. Ukiona mtoto wako ameenda Gulf, unataka kushukwa ile mshuko yenye i, i, ni latest. Unataka kuingia chama zote. Eh? Guys, wacheni niwaambie, hata kama mamako mzazi utaona akiku stress, block yeye. Block yeye pesa ni yako. Na wewe ndio ukifika Kenya ukiwa hauna pesa, wewe ndio wataanza kukusegenya. Wataanza kukuita majina my friend. Watakwambia ulikaa golf miaka hiyo yote ukatoka huko na zero. Pesa ni yako my friend, be wise enough. Kama itawezekana save three quarter. But I understand wa Kenya wenye wako golf, wao ndio baba na mama wa watoto wao. Unapata hata wengine they are not even able to save. Unapata umelipia watoto wako school fees pesa zote zikaisha. Alafu mzazi pale kazi yake ni kupiga makelele. Anitumiangi pesa, atutumiangi pesa ya chakula, sijui nini. Na unaona mtu anastrago, anastrago. Kwani munafikiri yanga wanalipangwa milioni ngapi? Au watu mwenye analipwa pesa mzuri ni 40,000. Gulf akunanga pesa. Unaonanga tu mtu kakiwa kame post picha mzuri unaona ni kama anafanya kazi kwa ofisi. Hizo picha wanapiganga na app ingine inaitwa Snapchat. 
wanapiga picha sasa hizo mtu hata ndio ametoka ndio unapatanga kuna wengine hata wanalalanga saa nne wengine hata saa tano wengine hata saa sita usiku na hata hakuna usingizi inakuja sasa hizo ndio umemaliza kazi saa sita hmm? Lazima uingie TikTok utese kidogo ndio watu wasianze kukutafuta. Uone kama uliuliwa. Uli mtu anaingia tu TikTok. Akiingia tu TikTok hivi. Ni za ngapi yani? Yani hata au watu wanateseka. Aki I wish I wish wazazi watatu tu wanaweza jitolea waende hizo countries. Waone vile watoto wao huwa wanateseka. Ndio mtu asikuja akaanza kukula nini pesa ya mtu mwenye ako golf. Kwani nyinyi wazazi 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 you are the biggest reason as to why Kenyans are dying in gulf countries. Mimi nayo si wadanganyi. You are the biggest reason as to why Kenyans uh, Kenyans are dying in gulf countries. What you are doing is wrong, totally wrong. Imagine mtu anafika, mtu anakutrust jueni mamake anakutumia pesa zake zote. Anafika, anapata 0%, zero savings. Mtu anajinyonga. Ama maybe anarudi tena gulf akiwa ana nini? Kama umekosana na mamako, kosana na yeye hata akitaka kukulani akulani. Nyinyi wazazi mumekuwa too much kwanza. Mumekuwa too much. Mimi niko na marafiki zangu more than 10 wamekosana na wazazi wao juu walienda tu golf ati umeenda golf mzazi wako mwenye amekuzaa anataka usomeshe ma sisters wako anataka uwalipie school fees za university we mwenyewe wa ukwenda university mbona wao wasiende tu golf watafute pesa ya university wajipeleke eh? ati unaona mtu ame, ako kwa bwanake amejifungua unatumiwa bill unaambiwa saidia sister yako aende akajifungue Nilikuwa hapo, nilikuwa hapo wakiekana hizo mimba. Ah, nyinyi wazazi manzi mnakosea. Mnakosea wacheni na wakenya wenye wako golf kwanza wafanye kazi. Anyway guys, tulikuwa tunatafuta James Chege. Mamake nimesema kwa Saudi Arabia, mamake anaitwa Elizabeth Wajiro, Wajira Chege. Tafadhali share this video. Share this video if you can. At least tuone mali yako. Watu wa Moranga Watu wa Dhika, watu wa Kiambu, watu wa Gidhuguri, hiyo sites. Sheni hii video at least tuone kama huyu mtoto atasaidika. Hata kama amekufa, hata kama alienda akajirusha mahali, bora mamake ajue. Na to najua atapatikana akiwa hai. So guys, continue subscribing to our to our channel na like the video and let me know what you think about it. Bye bye for now guys. I love you so much.